Pomeranians are more than just adorable fur balls. They have been around for centuries, and they have inspired many artists to create masterpieces on their behalf. Before the Pomeranian became an art inspiration, though, they were still trying to figure out life as a puppy. Pomeranian dogs weigh only a few ounces and fit in the palm of your hand, and on this topic you will learn information that you definitely did not know before about this wonderful dog. Size and Lifespan Height reaches 6 to 7 inches and weight varies between 3 to 7 pounds. Pomeranians live between 12 to 16 years on average. Breed Characteristics with a face filled with expression, Pomeranians are small, compact dogs with a thick fur coat. Their fur is double-coated, with a short undercoat and a longer outer coat. They also have a recognizable plume tail specific to the breed. Most notably, there are 23 colors of Pomeranian fur recognized by the American Kennel Club. This wide breed variety means each palm is destined to be slightly unique, though most come in an orange-red hue. Temperament with a big dog personality, Pomeranians are highly intelligent and aware of everything happening around them. Due to their size, they're happy being indoor pups and love companionship. Though small, Pomeranians tend to walk with a confident and proud gait. Anyone can see that they are 10 feet tall, on the inside. Grooming and health needs. As puppies, Pomeranians need only minimal bathing and brushing. As they mature, however, their coat needs attention. Besides brushing out palms regularly to keep the hair from matting, it's recommended to go to a professional groomer regularly to cut nails, clean ears and get fur trimmed. The classic teddy bear cut is a cute option for a palm. The National Breed Club recommends the following health exams for your new Pomeranian, patella evaluation, cardiac exam, and ophthalmologist evaluation. Training. Pomeranian puppies must be trained early and often in walking with a leash. Due to their petite size, they're prime targets for larger dogs or even bird predators. They must also be taught to come when called. Equally as important as training your palm to stop jumping. Their joints get strained when they jump, so consider getting dog stairs that go up to the couch or bed if they're welcome up there. Lastly, housebreaking is important. If your palm is mostly an indoor dog, make sure they know the bathroom rules of the home. Energy level. Pomeranians generally enjoy being lap dogs but need a lot of opportunities to run around and play. Like all dogs, early socialization is important for a Pomeranian puppy, but due to their petite size, make sure they're socializing with smaller dogs. Who is the best human for a Pomeranian? Pomeranians are perfect for family life, as long as any children are old enough not to roughhouse too much. Pomeranian puppies are very small and fragile, and young children may unintentionally hurt a smaller dog without even realizing it. Due to their size, city or suburban life can work well for these petite pups. Palms can be indoor dogs as long as they get short walks and indoor exercise. Lastly, because of their big personality, they are surprisingly excellent watchdogs. Getting a Pomeranian puppy Choosing to adopt or go through a breeder for your new Pomeranian puppy is a personal choice that requires research. Thankfully, there are many resources out there to help you find a rescue or breeder that offers healthy, ethically sourced Pomeranian puppies. Knowing what you're in for when you get a Pomeranian puppy is an important step in being a responsible pet owner. Whether you find a responsible breeder or are planning on adopting, it's up to you to be prepared for an energetic and friendly addition to your household. Adopting Pomeranian Puppies It may be surprising to know, but adopting a Pomeranian puppy is possible. According to the AKC, most breed rescues report that a majority of their rescue dogs come from individual owner surrender, with the most common reasons being a change in lifestyle or the breed not being a good fit for them. This means that there may be many dogs and puppies out there that are looking for a new forever home. The main difference between a breeder and a rescue is that a rescue may not always have young puppies to choose from. The benefit, however, is that most are mandated to only adopt out dogs that have been microchipped and spayed, neutered. This means you may end up with a dog that's already been housebroken, and doesn't need these common medical procedures. You may also find a Pomeranian mix that has all the traits you want from the breed, but with a little extra thrown in. Finding a Pomeranian rescue can be as simple as searching the internet. 
The AKC also has an excellent list of Pomeranian rescues on their site. Finding a Pomeranian breeder. The first step is to do your research. Sadly, there are many puppy mills posing as reputable breeders along with many online scams. Be aware, and reach out to different online forums for conversations about getting your future furry family member. Be sure to ask questions, make arrangements to meet the parent dogs or mother, and follow your gut. If something seems wrong at a breeder you visit, or the Pomeranian puppy seems too good to be true, there's likely something going on. The AKC also offers resources for finding a breeder, with fairly strict guidelines on who they let participate. 